tough loss the way you did last week. To come out and win this way, though, at the end, can, what does that do? What does it mean? Well, it gives you a little confidence that, you know, that if you stick together and you continue to, to work at it, you give yourself a chance. I mean, yeah, a couple of times we, you know, we try to hurt ourselves, but geez, oh, Pete, you know, when you get an opportunity, you, you, you get a chance to raise your, your opportunities and, and you bow your neck. That, that's what you need to do. Last defensive drive. Well, everything was fine until we let the kids scramble for 40 yards. I mean, that, that's that's the heartbreaker. I mean, you know, you you you've got them contained. You you know, you have a chance. You sack them on the first play. Um, you know, they they convert on their third down, and you know now you got them a little confused, and he pulls the ball down and runs. I mean, that's that that that's you know that that's that's. That's undisciplined. I mean, that, that, that's, that, that's where you get angry because, again, we had a chance to keep him. We had done a pretty, pretty good job with a lot of the rush lanes. And for whatever reason, we, we, we got a little undisciplined at the end. And it cost us. They got the ball down to the five-yard line. 12 men on the field twice. Yeah, that, that's unacceptable. That's unacceptable. Now, one of them, you know, I tried to get the timeout. They substituted late, and I was trying to get that straight. But, but, but the second one? That where, where they took the shot, that, that's unacceptable. I mean, that, 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 that will get correct. That will not, that will be addressed. I'll tell you that, I'm pissed off about that one. How does that, how does that happen, that second one? What happened? Well, somebody was cramping up, you know, I mean, trying to get off, and so we tried to substitute, and we got caught. What was your view on, the, on that very last play? I don't know what your view was, if you could see. Oh, um, I mean, we thought it was incomplete because we thought his left arm went to the ground first. <laughs> But as he was coming down, you saw the ball was on his, this side, and his back was to the uh, pylon, so thank goodness. It looks like uh, Carson's fingers got jammed there in the second. Yeah, he, I believe he bounced it off of somebody's helmet, but you know, he fought through it, kept his, kept his hand loose, you know, kept grabbing the, uh, the you know, inside his, uh, his pouch. He has um, the heaters, the little uh, heat packet, so he kept him to keep, that, to keep his fingers loose. Sorry, is there any consideration of a switch there? No, no. He was, he was handling it very well. It was a physical game. One of the things that we wanted to do is we wanted to come out and try and establish the run, which we, 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 which we were able to do. Um, you know, it, it was tough sledding at first, but if you stick with it, sometimes you get an opportunity to wear it down a couple times, and we did. We had a couple of nice runs. We had a nice little change up when Antonio came in in the second half, and he had a couple off, off tackle, and we thought that was really good. Um, and that really kind of changed a little bit of the momentum for us as far as our running game was concerned as well. Was that the big difference in the second half then? Because you had, it was a big difference in terms of yards. Was, it, was that? Yes, the yes. yes. It, you know, we, we hit a couple off tackle. Um, Antonio turned up a couple of, of really nice ones. I think he had one for almost 20 yards. And, and just really kind of what you hope. And that's what you kind of envision. You got, you know, you got, a, you got a, a stout runner that runs inside between the tackles. You got a guy with Antonio's athleticism can get off tackle and, and can really burst. So honestly, I'm going I'm to speak my mind for a second. For honestly, uh, it, it's been hard. It really has. You lose four games in a row, and everybody wants to get you, you know, just get on you. And they've played their asses off. They have. They play their asses off for everybody. They come out and they show up. They work hard. All right. They don't complain. Okay. They hear all the stuff and they got to deal with it. I get that. And I respect them for that because they're resilient. They come back. Everybody keeps wanting to say, I didn't want anything to do with Carson. Well, I'm. The Guy that pulled out the sheets of paper, that looked at the analytics, that watched the tape in the freaking when we were at Indianapolis, okay? And that's what pisses me off because the young man doesn't deserve to have that all the time. I'm sorry, I'm done. Do you want a sports network that delivers everything that matters about the game? The highlights, the picks, the instant analysis, no yelling, no fake debates, no politics. Hit the subscribe button and never miss a moment.